Hello and welcome to the fifth tutorial in the Cocos 2DX version 3 C++ tutorial series and in this tutorial we're going to look at how to add a sprite. This tutorial assumes you've done tutorial 4. If you haven't, don't worry, there'll be a link in the description to the source code or you can just implement it directly into your own project. Also, as usual, there'll be another link in the description to the source code that we're going to produce in this tutorial. So I'm just going to go ahead and open up in Xcode the project from tutorial 4. And then we're just going to go to the hello world scene.cpp and we're literally just going to do some housekeeping. We're going to get rid of everything that's on. Actually, we'll play first so you can see what we're going to get rid of. Click run. We're going to get rid of the background, we're going to get rid of the label and the menu which consists of a menu item. I mean, let's just turn off the application. But yeah, we're going to get rid of all of this code because we're going to start from scratch. So let's just get rid of this. Now that we've got rid of that, we're going to go to our hello world scene, the height, and add some variables. I'll just add the one. We're going to do cocos to the colon colon. Sprite. In old versions of Cocos 2D, you can do CC Sprite. You can still do it in here, but the code is deprecated. Recommended that you do not use deprecated code because it will most likely eventually be removed. We put asterisk. Now we put the name of our sprite. I'm just going to put my sprite. Semicolon. And now we go back to our hello world scene.cpp. Now we initialize the sprite. So sprite. I mean, no. My sprite equals sprite colon colon create and we're just gonna use the close normal.png and now we're just gonna position sprite with sprite keep on putting sprite instead of my sprite my sprite set position and in here we're gonna put point And the position we're going to set it is this center of the screen. So I'm going to do visible dot size dot width divided by two. And we're going to add on the origin as well. One second, let's just put this in brackets. I'm going to plus origin dot x. And we're going to do essentially the same for the height. So we're going to do visible size dot height divided by two plus origin.y mm, we are missing a bracket there we go and the next step is to simply add this sprite as a child to the layer so this add child and we're just going to put my sprite and got it right for once and you can also put a z index by putting a number here well, that is pretty cool as well but we don't really need that save it now let's run it in the simulator uh, oh let's start the semicolon there you go we've got the sprite in the middle of the screen if we try and click it it doesn't click because it's not a menu item it's just a plain old sprite in the next tutorial we're going to look at how to move this sprite using the move by method if you have any if you have any questions feel free to message us at support at sonarsystem.co.uk there'll be a link in the description for our email or you can just message us on youtube if you need any of the source code that'll be in the description via links and as usual thanks for watching